Alright, so on to the update notes. So, realistically, the update isn't that big. But, it is actually a huge update. Like, to, to Common and Sons, it is a massive update. So, we're just going to have a look at this end anyway. Entering Common and Sons building now gives you a special stasis effect that both makes the game much harder while massively increasing loot rates. Common and Sons now has extra lo lone bosses scattered randomly through the building. Now, I don't have any footage of this. I've seen some pictures on the um, Discord of like people finding a tendril in a toilet, like the little bathrooms and stuff like that, which is absolutely insane. I'm going to be doing streams on all this and getting footage on it, but this is just explaining the update, basically. Other large buildings now have a small chance to spawn extra bosses in other rooms, although nowhere near as frequent as commas. So that's cool. You know, obviously starting to find bosses in other rooms now, like trying to find them everywhere. Honestly, that's, that's brilliant. It's absolutely brilliant. Like, even if it's just a one in a hundred chance, you know, like you go in a hundred different rooms and eventually you'll find one boss in one of them rooms. You know, you just say it, it just makes the game much more interesting. Cameron Sons now has special music. I've actually heard the music. It's pretty, it's pretty good. But anyway, the uh, the Cameron Sons effects, you can see it on the screen anyway. You've probably already been reading it while I've been explaining stuff. When you now go in Comet and Sons, you get 100% XP boost, 100% find elite item chance, 100% find unique item chance, 100% find backpack chance, 100% find upgrade chance. So all the top tier stuff, yeah, you get 100%, so basically double chance. But, now, here's the big but. The negatives. Plus 100% incoming damage, so you are now taking double damage from zombies. Plus 100% zombie health. So zombies now have double the health. Plus 100% mutated health. That is going to be insane. Absolutely nuts. Minus 100% headshot damage. Ignore that. It has been nerfed. It was a bug. As you can see in the uh, note directly below by admin Bond himself. So yeah. Ignore the minus 100% headshot damage. It does not exist. Plus 100% infection chance, burn chance, radiation chance, bleed chance. Plus 30% sneak visibility range. Plus 30% visibility range. So zombies are going, have got double the health. They're going to do double the damage. And they're going to spot you a lot easier. And double the chance to, you know, infect you, burn you, radiate, bleed, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, so it's cool update. I really like it. It's finally gave us some end game. I've already had a little bit run around, like a little... You know run around in the building i've not done a lot i've only done the main hall the main building like the main room should i say jesus christ um and the hallways around it reason being because i want to stream the game tonight and obviously do it then so i'm saving it until then because obviously you can only do the run for it run through once and clear all the rooms at once but yeah that's that's it it's i, I it's interesting it, it is very interesting i, I really like this update I did suggest, like, I had a conversation we had been part a while back about um, turning Comrades into Comrades Sons into a type of raid where you have to do floor, 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 find a key, kill a boss. That'll unlock the next five floors, then the next five floors, blah, 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 blah. You know, we had a bit of discussion. He liked the idea of it, obviously. But yeah, I, I actually prefer this. I think this is way better because it just it makes the game a lot, a lot harder. So it's a cool update. Yeah, that's, that's the update. Anyway, make sure to check the description below for a link to my Twitch where I'm going to start streaming the game because I'm actually very excited to play Dead Frontier 2 again. I'm very excited to play this game for a while, but this update has really done it for me because I think this is going to be a challenge and I'm really excited to see what happens with it. So yeah, make sure to check the description for the Twitch link um, and you know all my other social links and all that good stuff. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. I hope it informed you of anything that you didn't know about the update. And hopefully I'll catch you in the next video or in the next live stream. So I'll catch you in the next one, guys. Peace out. Have a great time. And I'll see you in the next one.